Hi, Leo. Uh, this is your mid-month, so let's find out. I'm opulent spiritual. <laughs> uh, yeah, and let's see what's happening for you. All right, I'm already getting, like, where I can't hear my ears. They feel like they're clogged right now. And I just did a reading before you, and I was fine. So you're not hearing something. You're not hearing something. You're, you, you're clogged in your ears or something. Okay. The cup was stuck, but there was no splatters. So there is a wish coming true. Wow, look how clear that is. Wow, maybe you already know, but you're not listening. You're not paying attention and your your ears are clogged. Hmm. But it's not exciting. It's not exciting here. Why is that? Why 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 are you not excited? Hold on, let me see. Hold on. Um, let me see why you're not excited here. Because that's weird, right? Because it's like a wish. Oh, maybe it's something. <laughs> okay, I think I know it. Yeah, look, a wish. Nine of Cups. It's a wish, but maybe you didn't realize you manifested this and now you're like, you don't want it. Oh, well, now you got to take it now. It's a victory. Yeah, but how come you're not exci excited about it? Oh, because you, you've been waiting for this for a long time. So you, I feel like this new beginning, right? You've been waiting for this for a long ass time and you've been getting, uh, what is that called? Like discouraged for a while, maybe the last seven months or seven years could have been up to seven years. You've been waiting for this and you've been getting disappointed. So you kind of just gave up on it. And now that it's happening, <laughs> you're not excited about it. You know what I mean? You're like, okay whatever. Great. You know, you understand what I'm saying? Um, yeah, that's, uh, that's kind of sucky. Uh, <laughs> well, I hope you enjoyed it anyways. I know that sucks. I, I, I definitely can relate. So letter W is on the outside. There's nothing really on the outside here. Very clear cup. This is going to be quick, quick reading. You are talking a lot, communicating a lot with spirit, with friends, family, you feel really good. You're happy. You're good. You're very good. This is good. I'm seeing 32 here, 54, 37. Okay. Aries energy, 37 again. Letter S, letter R, letter K. Hmm. Well, you're elevating and there's something about the connection here to, to psychic connection here. So you could have a telepathic connection to somebody or something or your spirit guides. You're very connected and you're clear, like very pure here. So it's... I'm not seeing anything bad with this. I'm seeing love here. Love could be a little cloudy because it's engulfed in all this uh, coffee. Something about Florida, South America. Hmm. And I'm seeing that that thing that they use in that board game it's called sorry or something the board game is called i'm sorry or sorry i don't remember it's from i think like the early 2000s or something something about that board game i don't know what why that's here maybe somebody wants to tell you they're sorry i don't know something about i'm sorry here and yeah look, look at how this is so clear but there's definitely something with the nervous system and three points of contact here. Again, I saw this in someone else's cup too, a three point of contact. Hmm. So maybe you're the third point of contact or you're getting contacted by three different people at the same time. 
this could be connected to you leaving. You're you're definitely leaving a situation. You're you you've been do thinking about this for a while and now you're gonna leave. And maybe you feel very clear now that you can go. You have nothing holding you back. You're not scared anymore. Something with that. Now I'm hearing Hippocrates. Hmm. Okay, so I'm seeing the Six of Swords here. So you leaving a situation. Yeah, you're definitely leaving something here. Yeah, you're definitely leaving something. You have an eye here. But it's very clear. It's very light. So it's it's positive. I know it's like pointy in there. But I, you know what this is? This is someone that was not good to you, but you know who this is, so they can't hurt you anymore. It's not dark. So they're like way in the background of, of you. Like this is someone that has envy on you and, you know, all those things. But you know who this is, so you're not worried about this person. It's like, okay, whatever. They're They're over there. They can't bother me. I don't give a shit about this person. Chinese ear of the monkey, Chinese ear of the rooster. Of letter V here. So you have a victory here. And th th that's good. That's what that has to do with that six of wands, right? So you're definitely completing something. 104 is here. That's weird. Right here. 104. That could be a house number or a time. That maybe you're going to wake up from sleep. I'm definitely seeing love is here. It's small, though. So this could be someone you're already with, that you're talking to. I'm not seeing, like, anything new here. But there is a new journey, like the tarot said, you know? But you're not excited about it, you know what I mean? You're not. You're not. I'm not going to lie, you're not. And you're like, okay. I'm glad it's happening now, but I already got this. You got disappointed so many times, but look, it's here. This path, it's open now. Connected to one, two, three, four people here. And you have an X here. So maybe this is someone from your past. And I'm also seeing a rune. So you guys got a rune towards the end of the month here. Where is it? I'm seeing this one. You could see it. It's right here. Look. Hold on. It's right here. See it? Like that. Common. Common sense. Caring, family, love, home, and re relive. So that's something here with that. So it's like common sense here. And also that X here, gifts. Sorry, this is like, see, you're not seeing this clearly. That's why you're not. Gifts, personal relationships. With this one. There you go. And well, now you're definitely going to see it clear now. Okay. I'm using different coffee and it's very dark like I could see it. it's it doesn't smell good though that's the only thing it doesn't but it's like Italian coffee it's dark okay I'm seeing a rooster here Chinese ear of the rooster so definitely an announcement coming to you I'm seeing Chinese ear of the dragon you're rising above obstacles and endeavors that have been holding you back and troubling you it's like a brand new beginning with this phoenix Something connected to the liver and the bladder is here. So maybe this is a health concern. Maybe you're recovering from this. I'm also seeing a peacock here. So ego and pride, that's what's been really encasing you in this change. Like you didn't want to change because of your ego and pride. But now you are. Letter L, letter E, letter F. Yeah, and I'm seeing like the tree of life here and it's so big. So you are protected by your ancestors here. 
which is very beautiful. Letter K and number one, which is year of the rat and Capricorn energy. And something about orange juice here or citrus, oranges. Yeah, it's time to go now, right? Okay, they're saying one of these for you. Let's see. Number five. Taurus, change. You know, number five is the number of change. And year of the dragon. Enjoying life to the fullest here. New hobby. Being creative, learning something new. Scrapbooking, photos, online business, colorful. Looking good and feeling good. New health routine. Yeah, that's why your cup was like beyond clear. Glow up, change in the wind. Well, there you go. Maybe something with leopard print. Maybe you like leopard print. Hmm. Leo. Oh, tower wanted to come out. The king of cups. So you could be connecting to a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Hmm. This could be your father or a father figure in your life. Or this could be your spouse or someone at your job. Oh, this definitely has to do with love. Love. A choice in love, maybe. And if you haven't... Uh, if you're single and you haven't met anybody, this could be someone coming towards you and they're going to tell you their feelings. They're going to tell you how they feel. They're going to be very direct with you. Yeah, this is someone that's rushing into your life. This could be someone coming in to help you as well. But since the lovers is here, you're going to have a choice to make. It, you could have a choice between a water and air sign as well. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius or something that you need to take action on. Yeah, because you're living your best life right now. Your money's good. You're feeling really great. You're divinely guided. You feel protected and loved by spirit. Yeah, I'm hearing I have enough to share and spare. Which is very nice. Okay, this is connected to... Yeah, this is definitely uh, someone coming in love. This King of Cups. Big love here. Yeah, and you're going to be hearing about this maybe from this air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. This could be someone that's telling you about this person. Okay, that's kind of interesting why that took over your reading. Um, anything else? I feel like I want to pull one of these for you. Short journey. So you could be doing a little short journey, Chinese year of the horse, or in cancer season. And oh, oh, wait. Yeah, dating what came out like if went on the floor okay let's see from the angels here take action take action or this person's going to take action remain positive and don't stop all right and let go okay i'll take this one too because it's yeah water sign or season look at this and it just was falling out um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or July is the next water season, right? But they're saying take action, remain positive, and don't stop. So that's all I have for you. Thank you so much for being here. And if you like this, please consider subscribing, liking, and all that stuff. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one, all right? Good luck with everything. Namaste. Love and light.